And today is the, the feast day of uh, the presentation of the Lord, no? when we celebrate the gift of consecrated life. And and Father Tim did a great job of of just bringing about the, the idea that we're not following Christ in a better way, no, in a higher way. I'm not living and following Christ in, in a better way than, than everybody else. No, it's a special way. It's a different way. Pope Francis keeps saying that it's meant to be in a prophetic way, that all of us consecrated at baptism, no, all of us consecrated at baptism, all of us are called to follow Christ radically, no, really following Christ, being missionary disciples, that Christ is the center of my life for all of us, all of us baptized, meant to live in the church on mission, following Christ. No, but God is calling and he's still calling men and women to follow him in a special way, no, as Pope Francis says, in a prophetic way, perhaps really dedicating our entire lives. No, the fact that we don't have a family, I'm not married, I don't feel called to get married, I don't have my own children. No, so I am able to be free enough to love and to embrace and to move around and to really dedicate my life entirely to this mission. No, to the mission entrusted to us as Salesians, no, the education evangelizing of young people, especially those who are most poor. And so I'm free enough to do that. No, because really, I believe God has called me and I believe I'm trying to respond every day uh, to this call to follow Christ, poor, chaste and obedient by vow you know, to live in community you know, and to live in a community that's that's not bonded by blood. No, I'm living in a community with guys that I, I didn't choose, you know, that I was sent to live here. Guys from all different ages, all different cultures, all different places, you know, all different backgrounds. Um, I was sent here to live and I was given these brothers to love and they were given to me to love me and to to be there for each other. So we, we work together. We pray together. Uh, we're meant to relax and have fun together. Right. We are a community bonded by grace, you no know, bonded by the mission, bonded by our responding to God's call to be Salesians. And so we are you now following Christ, poor, chaste and obedient by by vow in community and then sent on mission and our mission like i said before is to to educate and evangelize young people especially those who are most poor and so this is the gift there are men and women all throughout the world you know and we give thanks for them and we pray for our consecrated religious all our brothers our sisters our priests who are following christ by vow who are living in communities who are being sent into the church to to live a specific mission um, and, and we give thanks for them. And we also we pray for the young people. No, we pray for all people that they may respond. Uh, there's people still today being called to this consecrated life. It is a gift to the church. And so we pray that people have the courage to respond to that call, you know, to follow Christ in this special way, in this prophetic way, dedicating our entire lives to him, to, to the poor, to the people of the church, to live in community, you know, sent on mission. And, and that's it. It really is a gift to the church. So uh, I thank you and we, we give thanks for, for the consecrated life um, and we continue to ask God to send send more people, you know, send more young people, men and women who are ready to respond to this call. And it's a it's a daily response. You no, know, it's not easy. It is a sacrifice. It's difficult. OK, but if you are called, if you feel you are called, that you may you have the courage, the humility, the grace to respond to that call you know, because it's a gift to the church. So it's a it's a beautiful thing.